If you want to know how to lose weight and stay fit by reprogramming your hypothalamic weight set point, then this is the video for you. Make sure to subscribe so I can help you get your hormones in harmony and optimize your health. And don't forget to click the bell so you'll be the first to know when I produce my new videos. Welcome back to The Hormone Healing Show. Today, I'm gonna to show you how your hypothalamus controls your weight. The problem with losing weight is yo-yo dieting. Every time you diet to try to lose weight, your hypothalamus protects you from what it perceives as starvation by raising your weight set point. Now it may not seem optimal to you, but stringent dieting is starving to your hypothalamus, who has your body systems dialed in with the exact amount of calories you normally consume. So when you stop dieting, you immediately put the weight you lost, plus some, back on. If you follow these three easy hypothalamus healing steps, you're going to reprogram your hypothalamic weight set point and lose weight naturally. Hypothalamus healing step number one, listen to your gut brain. Your hypothalamus controls your hunger hormones, ghrelin and leptin. Ghrelin increases your hunger, leptin makes you feel satiated. Your hypothalamus needs glucose to function and produces ghrelin in response to low blood sugar levels. Leptin is produced by your fat cells when they're full and tells your hypothalamus to stop producing ghrelin. Ghrelin is also produced by your stomach when you're thirsty. So drink water first when you feel hungry to suppress the production of ghrelin. If you're still hungry, then eat a light, balanced meal. If you still feel hunger pangs after you eat, that means your hypothalamus hasn't gotten the glucose it needs. Your food won't be digested that quickly, so eat a little bit of natural sugar, like fruit, to suppress hypothalamic ghrelin production. In my hormone reboot training, there's a delicious healthy recipe from my cocoa energy balls that works great to suppress ghrelin. Hypothalamus healing step number two, reset your weight set point naturally. Your weight is set by your hypothalamus. It may not be ideal to you, but it's the exact weight that your hypothalamus uses to direct all your vital body functions, including your metabolism, how fast you burn energy, how you use glucose, how much insulin you produce, how much glucose your liver and muscle store for immediate energy, how much glucose gets stored in your fat cells for later. The best way to lose body fat and help your hypothalamus adjust to your gradual weight loss is to follow a pulsatile insulin resistant diet. Plus add three high intensity workouts and one long slow distance a week. A pulsatile insulin resistant diet is basically a low carb paleo diet introducing carbs every three to seven days. The lack of carbs on your insulin resistant diet forces your body to use stored body fat for energy. Then adding carbs intermittently helps prevent your hypothalamus from slipping into starvation mode and slowing down your metabolism. Then you must expend the energy stored in your fat cells. So three mornings a week do a short HIIT workout. Early morning aerobic exercises raises your metabolism for at least 24 hours. Your body burns fat after 45 minutes of exercise, so add one long, slow distance a week, walking, hiking, cycling for over an hour that will keep you in fat burning mode. You can find more details on my best fat burning diet and exercise recommendations in the Hormone Reboot Training. Hypothalamus healing step number three, feed your hypothalamus. Your hypothalamus needs nutrients to do its job properly. If it doesn't get what it needs, your hypothalamus will do it the best it can for you to survive with what it perceives as starvation. Nutraceuticals specifically designed to support your hypothalamus balances your hormones. Balanced adrenal hormones means a healthier stress response and better fat and protein metabolism. Balanced glucose metabolism means better insulin sensitivity and less fat storage. Balanced thyroid hormones means a more efficient metabolism. Overall, a balanced hypothalamus means a slimmer, stronger, fitter body. It's hard to get all your phytonutrients your hypothalamus needs from your diet alone. That's why I created Genesis Gold, to help my patients get back in balance naturally. Now you know how to lose hypothalamic weight, yet it's not easy to lose that inflammatory fat if the rest of your hormones are out of balance. So I created the Hormone Reboot Training for you to discover how to balance your hypothalamus and all of your hormones naturally. It's free. Just click the link in the description below this video. 
So what's one thing you're going to do to help lose the body fat? Leave your answer in the comment section below and make sure you sign up for my Hormone Reboot Training. If this video was helpful, be sure to subscribe, share with your friends, and hit the like button so I know to make more videos like this. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.